Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back. Hey guys, welcome back. And today I'm bringing you my five top favorite blushes. I got fall, winter, summer, spring. These are just always my five top to go. And I absolutely love each and every single one of them. I got some high end, I got some drugstore. So if you wanna know what I got, just keep on watching. So first I'm gonna start off with the most well-known blush and it is the Milani Luminoso. For those of you who do not have this, you do not know what you're missing. This is a drugstore product and I did buy this at Walmart, I believe for about $6. And I use this a little bit in the spring, the summer. I use this in all seasons to be honest and it is a beautiful peachy, it's peachy. There's nothing else, it's just beautiful and peachy and here is a swatch do you see how beautiful that is I absolutely love it and they do have I believe like five or six other shades don't quote me but I do believe that's how much they have they're very beautiful very pigmented such a high quality for such a good price so I really recommend this one and I'm sure a lot of you already have it so I just wanted to share that I really like this one next I'm going in with the Urban Decay Afterglow and this is the eight hour long lasting wear and this one's a little bit more vibrant and they're kind of bouncy and soft. I actually did get this in one of my hauls and I have a video on it. So I'm just gonna swatch it for you really quick and this is like a hot pink. This is very summery and very bam. When you wanna really make your look pop, this is what you use and you have to really be careful in how you pair this with your eye makeup and your lip because this can make you look like a clown if you're not being careful. So I really do like this one. They are a little bit more on the pricier side. I believe it was $24 to $28, but I really do enjoy the pigmentation. I love their variety that they have. They have many, many different colors you can choose from. So I really do enjoy this one, and this one is more of my spring summer blush. Next, I'm going in with my Too Faced blush and this is in baby love and I have showed this in a few of my videos and it is beautiful and this one's the one I always go to in the fall and this is what it looks like and I'm gonna swatch it for you really quick it is a mauve a very soft mauve with a hint of pink here it is over here and it's very pigmented very long wearing once I know I put it on I know I'm gonna have blush by the end of the day still on my cheeks so I really do enjoy it they have a very good variety also it's very pigmented and it's very easy to blend in your face you can also build it up sometimes I do have to kind of build it up if I'm going with like a bronzier look and I need my blush to show through more so I just kind of double up on the layer of this blush and it is beautiful great I have two more blushes to show you and the last two are elf blushes and they're very affordable if you guys do know I do a lot of makeup products on elf because I really think they're great for the price and great for the quality. So first I'm gonna show you the Pressed Mineral Blush and this one is in Sweet Retreat. This one is very beautiful. This is what it looks like. I'm gonna take a swatch really quick so you guys can see what it looks like. This is kind of like the Baby Love but it's more of a pink. More of the Too Faced blush but it's more of a pink. Here it is. It's like a soft baby pink with a tint of mauve and a tint of taupe. It is such a beautiful color to just warm up your cheeks and give you that nice flush look fresh. So I love this one and it's very affordable. I actually got this one in one of my e.l.f. hauls. So I really do like this one. And this one I can actually go throughout every single season because it just gives a little pink to your face. And that's what I love in like when I put blush. I don't go for that full on bam look all the time. I usually go for that nice flushed soft wake up look. And this is what it gives you. So I really do like this one. And I got one more e.l.f. blush. And this one is the Baked Blush. I'm sure a lot of you have heard about this because they're really, really good. And those of you who do not know, when you have a baked product, you can either spray Max Fix Plus on it to make it more pigmented. Or you can just wet it a little bit, like on your brush, and then just go in with it. And this one is in the shade Passion Pink. And this is what it looks like. It has little streaks of pink in there. It has some bronzies. It has some browns, it's very beautiful. And this is really, really pigmented once it is wet. And also this is very, very easy to apply. And this is more of like a softer peachy pink. Here it is. This is a really good blush that I enjoy because it's really versatile and I can use it for many different looks. And that was actually the last 
blush that I did have to show you. I really do enjoy each and every single one of these products. And I did get most of these on really good deals. I got my Milani on a good uh, promo code. I got my two Elfs on a promo code. But I did pay full price for my Too Faced blush and also my Afterglow by Urban Decay. So I hope you really did enjoy this. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at StaceLeanne1. And I see you guys in my next video. Bye.